Hello everyone, you are watching the Sunrise Channel. Armored personnel carriers are one of the most important components of the armies of the world. They allow you to safely transport personnel on the battlefield, as well as cover them with weapons mounted on the machine. Today, we want to show you the rating of the best armored vehicles in the world. The best military armored personnel carriers in the world. Boomerang, Russia. The Boomerang is a clean sheet design. It is not based on any previous Russian APC. Actually, it resembles Western-wheeled armored vehicles. Design flaws of the previous Soviet and Russian APCs such as rear-mounted engine, side exit, and cramped crew compartment were fixed. It is believed that maximum level of all-round protection with add-on armor is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. Vehicle has a V-shaped hull and can survive mine blasts. The Boomerang is fitted with remotely controlled turrets armed with a 30mm cannon, coaxial 7.62mm machine gun, and four launchers with Cornet M anti-tank guided missiles. There is also a version armed with a single 12.7mm machine gun. Vehicle is fully amphibious. On water, it is propelled by two water jets. The M1296 Dragoon, USA. The M1296 Dragoon is an upgraded version of the M1126 Striker with significantly increased lethality. Its official designation is Infantry Carrier Vehicle Dragoon, or ICVD. The first operational M1296 Dragoon was delivered to the US Army in 2017. The M1296 Dragoon is a well-protected and well-armored APC. Maximum level of all-round protection with add-on ceramic armor is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. This vehicle was designed to survive mine blasts. It is claimed that Striker Series vehicles are superior to other armored personnel carriers regarding survivability against mines and improvised explosive devices. Dragoons employed in combat zones can be fitted with steel cages called slat armor that provides protection against anti-tank rockets and missiles. Recently, an explosive reactive armor kit was designed for this vehicle. The M1296 Dragoon is fitted with an unmanned turret armed with a 30mm cannon. It can effectively engage lightly armored vehicles up to a range of 3,000 meters. This cannon also fires airburst rounds that explode above the target. It allows to hit people hiding in trenches and behind walls. These rounds are also effective against unmanned aerial vehicles. There is also a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. Dragoon is fitted with a battlefield information management system. Boxer, Germany slash Netherlands. The Boxer is one of the latest and most advanced armored personal carriers. It was jointly developed by Germany and the Netherlands. As with all German vehicles, it is well engineered and reliable. It is a truly modular vehicle with interchangeable snap-in modules. It uses a different chassis for different purposes, including infantry carrier, command vehicle, ambulance, supply carrier, and so on. Modules can be replaced in less than an hour. Some other armored vehicles also claim to be modular, however they never really exploit their modularity. Modular armor of the Boxer is made with special ceramic mix. Every mission module has its own primary safety cell. It is claimed that front armor withstands 30mm rounds. All-around protection is against 12.7mm fire. Damaged armor slabs can be easily replaced in field condition. The triple hull floor is shaped for maximum protection against anti-tank mines. Also, this APC has low radar and acoustic signatures, making it harder to detect. Despite being well protected, the standard Boxer is armed only with remotely controlled 12.7mm machine gun or 40mm automatic grenade launcher. Eaton, Israel. The Eaton is a new Israeli APC. It was developed to meet requirements of the Israeli Defensive Forces IDF. Actually, it is the first wheeled 8x8 APC developed in Israel. A prototype of the Eaton was first publicly revealed in 2006. 
After testing, this armored vehicle was approved for procurement. Mass production commenced in 2020. It will become operational with the IDF in 2021. The Eaton has a typical layout for a modern APC. It weighs around 30 to 35 tons and is well protected. Actually, it could be one of the most protected wheeled APCs in the world. The vehicle has a V-shaped hull for improved protection against mines and improvised explosive devices. Most likely that front arc withstands hits from 25 to 30 millimeter cannons, and all-round protection is against 12.7 millimeter or 14.5 millimeter armor-piercing rounds. In terms of mine protection, it is likely that this vehicle was designed to withstand blasts equivalent to 10 kilograms of TNT. The Eaton will be fitted with Iron Fist, an advanced active protection system. Prototype of the Eaton is fitted with a remotely controlled weapon station armed with a 12.7 mm machine gun. Other weapons such as a 30 mm or 40 mm automatic cannons will be also available on production version of the Eaton. This APC is powered by a turbocharged diesel engine developing 750 horsepower. Patria AMVXP, Finland. The Patria AMVXP is a newer, improved, and more capable version of the Patria AMV, which is currently one of the best armored personnel carriers in the world. This armored vehicle was first publicly revealed in 2013. The Patria AMVXP has a maximum combat weight of 30 tons. It is heavier than the standard AMV, which is already one of the heaviest and most protected armored personnel carriers in the world. Considering its protection levels, a well-armed Patria AMVXP can be seen as a wheeled infantry fighting vehicle IFV rather than a wheeled armored personnel carrier. With maximum level of protection, the front arc of the AMVXP withstands 30mm armor-piercing rounds. All-around protection is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. Vehicle also has a top-class mine protection. It withstands blasts equivalent to 10 kilograms of TNT under any wheel or anywhere under the hull. Up-armored AMVXP can survive hits of RPG-7 rockets. An NBC protection system is fitted as standard. The Patria AMVXP can be fitted with various weapon systems, either remotely controlled or turret-mounted weapons. A baseline armored personnel carrier is purposed with a remotely controlled weapon station armed with a 12.7 mm machine gun. This armored vehicle is powered by a Scania DC-13 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 603 horsepower. The Patria AMVXP has amphibious capability. On water, it is propelled by two rear-mounted water jets. However, once extra armor is fitted, it is no longer amphibious. LAV 6.0 Canada The Canadian LAV UP or LAV 6.0 is an upgraded version of the LAV 3 Kodiak. The upgraded LAV 6.0 weighs significantly more than the original LAV 3. A fully upgraded vehicle with add-on armor kits weighs just over 28 tons. Protection has been improved, though many of the core design elements remain the same. Currently, it is one of the most protected armored personnel carrier in the world. It can be considered as a wheeled IFV. The most notable difference of the upgraded LAV 6.0 is a double V-shaped hull. It was added for improved protection against landmines and improvised explosive devices. Crew members and troops are seated on energy-absorbing seats. Vehicle retains a ceramic add-on armor kit of the original LAV 3. It looks like with this kit, maximum level of all-around protection is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds, and the front arc withstands hits from 30mm cannons. Cage armor can be installed for protection against anti-tank rockets and missiles. The baseline Canadian Army vehicle has a two-man turret, armed with an M242 Bushmaster 25mm chain gun. This weapon has an effective range of 2.4 kilometers. There is also a coaxial 7.62 millimeter machine gun. Another 5.56 millimeter machine gun is located on top of the roof. Other weapons can also be fitted. 
The LOV 6.0 has improved fire control system with an integrated target detection, recognition, and identification system. It automatically corrects for target range and crossing speed. Turret sights have been upgraded. The new thermal sight and intensification sight have extended ranges. So overall surveillance capability of the vehicle is improved. The gunner can spot a man at a range of 1.2 kilometers. Furthermore, the LOV 6.0 has got a new battlefield management system. This armored vehicle is powered by a 450 horsepower Caterpillar diesel engine. The LOV 6.0 is not amphibious. That's all friends, thank you for watching. Leave your comments. Which armored personnel carrier did you like the most? Subscribe to the channel and like to be the first to see these cool and interesting videos.